Let's talk about the elephant in the room. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Lexi, and today we are trying out the new and improved Rev Air for the first time. So, if you're not new here, you know I've actually never tried the Rev Air, and I've been wanting to, but I never did. And they sent me the new one! I'm so excited because I am such a lazy natural. I'm quick to blow dry my hair and put it in a protective style, especially the last few years. Like, listen, quick to put it up. And my birthday is next week and I am putting it up again. So I'm getting my hair done in about 45 minutes and <laughs> I need to stretch it. So I'm gonna try it out, I'm so excited. The OG one was bigger. Let me know if you guys have tried the Rev Air before or if you're interested in it. I went through, I read the instructions for the most part. My hair is washed, conditioned, towel dried, um, detangled and all of that. It's pretty much like, I wanna say like 75, 85% dry. So I'm gonna just quickly test this out for the first time. I know a few people that have one and they love it and I've seen millions of videos on this product so i'm ready so let's just no need for long talking no need for long talking we're just gonna dive right in because anything that makes my hair life easier i'm on it like i'm on it <laughs> so it says for kinky coily hair the average drying time is between 60 and 90 seconds to start on level two and then raise it up so my hair is an eight twist i'll probably end up um breaking this into two this one twist right here just to be safe is my first time ever using this um it's really detangled really soft but i'm gonna put a little bit of this suave detangler spray i really like this i got an npr quite a bit ago um but i find that my hair really likes it and it smells great so i'm just gonna like put a little bit because i don't want it to wet up my hair so this video is not sponsored, but like I said, Rev Air did send me this dryer and I am just so excited and I want to be able to give you guys an honest review. This combing probably sounds crazy, but it's actually doing just fine. It says to start by putting the tension on a level two and then this is the heat setting on low. So let's see what happens. All right, they're not playing with us. Because for a heat setting of, or for the low heat setting and a tension of two, this is amazing. This little bit of heat and little bit of, I'm excited, hold up. No, I get it, I get it, look at this. And the hair is fully stretched. Since my hair is not soaking wet, which I never blow dry personally on soaking wet hair, I think it's even better um, because it's just easy, quick, you know what I mean? What I always do, because I always use the Revlon One Step, and what I always do with that one is I twist my hair up or braid my hair up, and the next day when it's like damp, almost dry, that's when I'll go in with the blow dryer. The results are really good for like, that wasn't even a full minute because my hair is not super wet. That's the key. I'm here talking like it's not like it's not blowing. It is so stretched. And today I'm having knotless braids installed. This is perfect for what she's doing. Perfect for what she's doing completely. So I'm kind of in a rush because she's on her way to my house. 
the stylist. I need to just quickly get through this, but I did want to give you guys like a demo, show you how it works on my hair. And 10 out of 10, you'll be seeing this again on my channel. Like you'll absolutely be seeing me use this product because what? So for experiment's sake, I'm gonna go to tension three same low heat and see how it looks all right this is with the tension of three the roots are definitely more straight with that tension Hmm. If I really want to sit here and do smaller sections and like put the tension higher, I could get the hair super straight. But for like stretching routines, nah, this is it. This is lit. And so much less pressure on my arms and my shoulders. I'm excited. And I just did that one twist by itself, <laughs> trying to be lazy. <laughs> I like how it worked out. I'm gonna twist up this hair so we don't have um, freaking uh, frizzing up and tangles because it will do that. I was watching some videos and like all of the people, they'll like, you know, massage or kind of like rotate or go up and down with the, um, with the base of it to get the roots. And I did that for the second, for this third section. And I noticed those roots were definitely more stretched than the other roots. I can just spend a little bit more time on the roots and get them a little bit more stretched. I normally go for the Olaplex um, oil for my blow dries because it has heat protectant properties in there. But this said not to put any oils. And I'm being a good listener. <laughs> we're gonna do tension three again. I love it. Oh, this is a dream. Let's talk about it. Let's talk about the elephant in the room because I know you guys are like, okay, Alexia, the price is hefty, you know? And honestly, this is kind of like one of those things that's like a luxury to have because it is so convenient. So if you're someone that likes to purchase items that make your life easier, I could see how this would be on your list. Now, if you're someone that doesn't mind blow drying with a more affordable option that will get the job done, <laughs> like I've been doing for years, also makes a lot of sense. I just, have to be honest that it works it works well it does what it says it's gonna do all the videos all of the like reviews it works and I can see why if you have a bunch of hair and for me my hair is just so thick it has taken me a while to figure out like a really easy and effective way to blow dry and I have figured that out but this is like even better because of the fact that I just stick my hair in the hose and like it's doing all the work for me you know so much less passing with the brush so much less effort which isn't that I really I get it the roots got really straight I need a trim wow the roots got I need to trim bad. The roots are getting really straight now that I get that I have to do a little bit more effort. Um, I'm gonna up the tension, just out of curiosity. If I wasn't filming, I would have been at seven by now, but I'm trying to, you know, take my time. So I'm gonna up the tension to five, just to see how much faster this can get. So look at the difference. Shrinkage, no shrinkage. I can't even tell because my hair is all black, but yeah. <laughs> Girl, shut up. Absolutely. The tension higher is better. 
Look at the difference between the tension at five and at three. Like it's even smoother. Now we about to get lit. We about to turn up. I'm about to turn up on them because this, I feel like this tension is good for like a sleek style or like, you know, I don't know, cause I don't do much, but like a sleek style. And then this tension or like a pre flat iron sleekness. This is good for like protective styling or just a quick stretch before styling. So this would be good for it. But look at the difference. Like nah, I'm about to go up to seven. <laughs> Cause it's it's an option. It's an option. We're taking it there. Okay, we're taking it there. It's one of those things where I get the hype. I get it. Sometimes you can say like, oh no, like it's not worth it, blah, blah, blah. Like, no, I get the hype. It just makes sense. <laughs> I've been sitting here for half an hour. I've been talking. I've been stopping to talk. I've been, you know, making a YouTube video and I'm halfway done with my hair in half an hour. Could you imagine if I just like was sitting in front of the TV, boom, 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 boom. I could probably do my whole hair in 45 minutes. So I'm actually gonna be quiet now. My stylist is about 15 minutes away and I'm gonna just do my hair do a little time lapse for y'all and let y'all know how fast this goes. So this is the second half of my hair. We're starting it at 12.56. So let's get into it. So many things have taken place before this love affair began. If you feel like a fan. I just did high heat for the first time. I like it. I don't really need it, but I like it. Last section and it's, I said it was 1256 and now it's 110. So I've literally done this section in less than 20 minutes. I've done this half of my head in less than 20 minutes. All right, so I tried high heat with this one and I turned it down because it was a little bit too hot on my scalp, but it looks great. It looks really good. Y'all can see it. Y'all can see This is definitely enough stretching for any protective style. And when it comes to like the blow dry time, I'm feeling it. I'm feeling it. I probably would use a brush as opposed to a comb next time to, this is all the hair I lost, which is like, what is that, nothing. Well, to me, I lose a lot of hair, so. But um, I probably use a brush next time just because I feel like my ends could have been smoother and if I brushed it, it probably would have been smoother. This is a great blowout that literally took me, at this point, it's been 50 minutes, but it took, the actual blowout probably took like between 30 to 45 minutes if I wasn't recording a video. So that's crazy by itself. The hair is soft, the hair is stretched. It doesn't feel like I even put heat on it. When I was taking it out of the Rev Air, it didn't even feel like it was hot, which when I use my Revlon One Step, that thing be hot, like hot. <laughs> you guys can see this half of my hair is shrinking back up. It's so wild. It's humid inside the house. Like it's literally shrinking back up. Look at that, that's crazy. Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know down below in the comments. What do you think? Are you a Rev Air customer? Do you want to be? Like, have you been thinking about it? Honestly, honestly, wow. I'm here to give you guys results. So do what you want with what I've shown you. <laughs> Thanks for watching guys, give the video a thumbs up on your way out. Thank you so much to Rev Air for providing me with this dryer because I will be using this. Y'all will be seeing this on Instagram, TikTok, you everywhere because this is convenience. Bye guys. Bye.